Hey people, how's it going? We're back. I figured out what we're gonna do since it's ten, well, quarter to eleven in the morning. We're gonna go see if we can talk to the king or prince. We're gonna talk to the cops about the murders. And hopefully by the time we figure all that shit out, it will be nighttime and we can go find out what's eating the bones. But doing the murders, or solving the murders, we have to go to Tarant to talk to somebody anyway. So, yeah. Let me ask you some questions. Can I just pop in? Oh, hello. Can we just go in? <coughs> I guess so. Ooh, that's not good. Um, isn't there a prince or something supposed to be here? Um, let's talk to this guy. Okay. Upstairs? Why is that door locked? Why can I not go in there? Wait, let's talk to the dude. I need to talk with the prince. If I don't talk to the prince, I'm gonna sit in his chair. Wait, that's unlocked. All right. Can we get into that hallway? This way, maybe? Unlocked. Let's try. The worst that's going to happen is I have to reload. Do, 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 do. Come on, everybody. Wait for him to go bye bye. Close the door. All right, where does this go? Well, balls. I guess that's not where we need to go. Where's the friggin' de facto leader of this junk hole? Lame. He's not one of those rulers that goes down to the pub and has a drink, is he? Alright. Where's the cop? Oh, the cop shop's over here. Do do uh, up this one. <sighs> I believe this is it. Caledon Police Headquarters. Sir, sir, excuse me, sir. Any new developments in the murders? I don't have time to entertain travelers. Why should I listen to your babbling? Just came down for help. A foreigner's gonna help us out. Well, I've got nothing to lose here. All these imbeciles working for me can't turn up anything. First murder site is at one white church landing between Grey Wolf Terrace and Temple Road. The second was at 21 Dragon Turnabout. Go over there, look for clues, and fuck the right off. Should I know anything first? Well, the white church murderer, as the journalist have been calling him, likes prostitutes. We got s one back there, goes by the name Renee. She caught a glimpse of the degenerate while he was cutting up a friend of hers. She demanded we lock her up for her protection because it spooked her. You can go talk to her if you want. Can you tell me anything about the murders? 
He likes to cut the hearts out of his victims with surgical precision. He seems only to attack prostitutes. The best description of we have of him paints him as a scrawny individual, maybe an elf. We'll talk to Renee. That's a mighty nice dress you have. Uh, I'm not a constable, I'm just an interested citizen. Are you some sort of degenerate? There's a madman on the loose and you're just interested? Degenerate, I'm not the prostitute here. I'm just as the gods made me, madam. I do what I need to, to survive. So do I. Your dress looks awful pretty, too. I can tell you what I've seen. It's the most horrible vision I've ever beheld. Pale skin, slightly shadow of a man kneeling over Emily. It was the sight I shall never forget. Well, then start at the beginning. We were out working. Emily had forgotten something or other at her home. I waited for her outside, but she never came out. So I went inside, and there she, there they were. You didn't see him go in the house. No, there's no way to enter the house, and I couldn't see him from where I was standing. Okay, what did he look like? It was difficult to tell, really, without the blood. He was a slight man, possibly an elf. He didn't appear to be possessing such physical power. He might have cast a spell of some magic on her he did. I like that. Drop the H, finally. Anything else? Kill the bastard that cut up Emily. He deserves to suffer as he, she did. Try my best. Uh, I'll gladly do it if you give me your dress. <coughs> cough, cough. Alright, let's head over to White Church Lane. And, 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 Dragon Turnabout. White Church Lane is around here somewhere. Come on. There we go. Now if I click there, will I find my way? Hails, yeah. Talk to the police officer. Inspector sent word we should be expecting you. I don't know how you did it. I'd tip my hat or if I were wearing one. Go on in if you got the stomach for it. Is this a naked woman? Okay, is everybody in here? Alright. Small metal object. Is there... Exer Exertion seemed to have no effect on what looks to be a trap door. It's much too heavy for you to move. Sog, can you move this shit? Alright. I'm gonna try something. Don't you people say anything. This is for the greater good. Ness. I don't normally do it. Who killed you? Do you know? Lana, M Lana Milak. He seemed to be fighting with himself. He wrote his name in blood on me, then wiped it off screaming. Let's... Lana Malak. I thought he was a gentle elf. But once we started, he turned into a hideous demon. That's all I know. I died quickly, though, painfully. Please, let me go now. There's nothing else? He was evil. A demon. Please, I know nothing else. I release you. Remember, nothing happened. Hi. That was gross. Uh, excuse me, I have to go puke now. <clears throat> what? Don't look at me like that. Just don't. It's perfectly normal. I don't do it all the time. Alright. We got the stomach for it. It's just a dead body. A trap door. Seems to be too heavy to move. Hmm. Alright, same as last time. None of that kinky shit. <laughs> Help me. Oh, God. Alright, I'm sorry.
Alright. Task of finding the murderer. Anything here? Nothing new. All right. Let's go back to the cop shop and tell them what's going on. And see if we get any new developments. Development. <sighs> what the hell am I doing? That was some weird ass shit. Alright. I have information. What is it? Okay, there are chop doors in each of the murder sites. Remnants from the old city sewers. No sentient being in all of Arcanum is strong enough to lift them. The sewer maintenance blokes need to access them. They use some type of machine. There's another murder to worry about. Now, the man Rene said describes that he was slight. Wouldn't have mattered if the strongest ogre in Arcanum did it. Takes several to lift one of those old covers without machinery. Hmm. But she didn't see anybody go in or out of the house. She didn't see him leave because she's running away, screaming hysterically, and the maniac probably broke into the house before Emily went inside. All I know is it's not possible to lift those covers. Okay, where's the latest murder scene? 23 Kingsway, the Mushroom Inn in one of the rooms. Okay. Well, well. It's all coming together. Man, I hope it wasn't my room. But she did it. I guess we can just go in. All right. What the fuck is that shit? Don't stand in it. Biscuit, biscuit, get out. Get out of that shit. The word Lana Malak written in what appears to be green blood. That's disgusting, Peyton. Are there any, um... Okay. No trap doors. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. Well, back to it. We've done our investigating. Man, lunch needs to hurry the fuck up. I'm hungry. Is it up this way? God, I'm good. It's like I was already here. Alright, I'm gonna save for talky stuff. New information. I was gonna tell you this. I saw the name... Lana Malak, written in green blood. Sounds like a demon name. I hate demons. I ever tell you about that Amalek demon that ran amok around here? I was slogging through some godforsaken swamp to find some ridiculous looking dagger to kill the thing. Catch it by a good ceremonial dagger at the corner store. Why green blood? Why write its own name? I don't know. The only person that might know is a demonologist. Um... 
I'll send you to talk to the one that helped me out, but uh, he had a run in with the demon I was hunting. See, they don't like each other. You best be prepared to go fight some heinous creature in a dark dungeon. Plain demons. Why do I get a case where I go to some tropical island to solve it? I'm too old for this balderdash. Hurry it up. The king's advisors get wind of the murder being a demon. They'll try me. They'll try to call him Pain. Who's Pain? He's an overrated, overinflated, self-important, big game hunter. The bloke just tracked down and killed just about everything he could think of, and everyone goes running at him at the slightest hint of trouble. I don't need his arrogance mucking up my investigation. I'm capable of getting his handled myself. Thank you very much. Okay, well, um, don't you mean me? I'm going to have to begin dealing with your preposterous arrogance now. If you want the job, great. If not, leave me be. Calm down. I'll do the job. All right. So I have to go to Tarant now to talk to the demonologist at the university. He's noticed he didn't, he conveniently left out the name of this guy. But before we leave, we're going to solve the murders of, or the bunny killings. Sort of. Am I crazy or have I passed? I'm not crazy. You don't happen to have ogre stuff, do you? Because I would love to get Saga into something other than guard leather. Let's talk to her. May I ask you a question? What goes on around here? Yep. Thank you. I thought maybe she'd give me money for surviving the IFS Zephyr crash. But new. All right. Gonna go here. Actually, we'll go up here. Let me scratch my arm. Hey, Paul, how's it hanging? What are you doing? Alright, it is... Timo? Click on it! We have fight music. Everybody just wait. Paul, it probably isn't a good idea to be He's out done. here. There's the bunnies. Oh! Oh, we got a dead bunny. I'm happy to see you again. It's you that's killing the bunnies. What are you talking about? I would never harm the rabbits. I saw you transform into a werewolf with my elven eyes that I don't have because I'm actually a human. No, it can't be. That would explain the dreams. Oh no, what are we going to do? Uh, mm? Talk to my dad. Dad's know everything. All right, chill. Hey, yeah, I found out what's happening to the bunnies. Um, Cynthia's doing it. What? She's a werewolf. What? Oh, we might have to kill her. What? Have you heard of a cure? No. Here travels, if you happen to find a cure, think of us. I heard there are astounding cures in the great mage city of Tula. Tula. I will be on my way. Oh yeah, I'll also look for cure. Awesome. I, 
I love you, bunnies. I'm sorry I wasn't there to save you, my bunnies. My money friends. Come on. Oh, that's right. Stop waiting. Let's go. What is it that you want of me? I'm ready to get going. Let's go. Charmond. Um. Rejoin. All right. There we go. So, we've got to find a cure for Cynthia. And her dad suggested at Tula. Go us. Yay! Well, let's travel to Caledon. Caledon. I'm cute, aren't I? Tarant. Trade me. Give me this thing. And a shovel. Alright. Let me get to up here. Hey, buddy. Anarchist laborers take over factory. Read all about it. God damn, son. Right, I'm gonna save. That'll be it for today. I will see you tomorrow. We will do more with Arcanum. We gotta talk to a demonologist. And then we'll pop back. I gotta find out where the king de facto leader of Caledon is. So, I will see you tomorrow. Adios.